Hello everybody out there in social media. This is looking outside my front door here at the Poor Boy Ranch. Of course we're inside, you know, it's winter time. I'm still looking outside my front door and my front window. Of course my front window and my front door are only a foot apart, foot two foot two feet apart. <laughs> so you know really not far from one or the other. But that's okay. I like being going from my uh, living room to my kitchen. The only thing I got to do is stand up. It makes things easier. Uh, cancer still going good. I'm on heading towards my survival date still. Still doing good there, everybody. Uh, I hope that this year brings you everything and you want and the blessings you all desire. And... Uh, Maybe brings you closer to God. Um, not much else going on here. Uh, you know, it's winter time. It's downtime, relaxing time, watching the scenery time. You know, or what trucker might call window time. <laughs> Bears over on the bed to sleep, sacked out, and. Uh, Shadow, she's over here in the bathroom, sacked out. Uh, she seems to like to lay by the water bottles in, that I put in my shower tub. I don't use it except to store water. I don't have enough water to take a shower. I use wet ones. You know, these kind of things. They keep you... Keep you clean without using a whole lot of water. You can serve a lot of water. I do save a lot of water by using wet ones. Yeah. Well, granted, I, you know, uh, nothing like a good hot shower, you know, to energize a body. But uh, when you don't have that kind of thing and it's not feasible to have it, you know, you do what you got to do. And it works. But I also went down, I paid bills, got my land payment made and to John and and uh, bought supplies and came home and uh, found a nifty little deal wise in town and uh, went to uh, get another flashlight. <clears throat> Because this one here is starting to give me fits. Um, so, I'm gonna, I think I, if I stretch the string, I might be able to do it. But, uh, see, it starts to go out. Starting to, yeah. It's been banged around one too many times. So, you know, I'll figure it out. Figure out what's wrong with it. <clears throat> tighten it up but in the meantime i wanted to get some new ones for an update that's five years old and of course my mag light's even a lot older but that runs d cells and that's expensive so of course the triple a's are not much cheaper either but for emergencies and stuff for what i use flashlights and stuff for you know the different times it'll work um i went and found a little deal i got two of these these are little pocket flashlights. Uh, got one blue, one gray, and they light up pretty good. And uh, yeah, also in that same kit, I got two of these little flashlights that came in that kit, and they light up pretty good. You know, something for emergencies. They all use AAA batteries. But the one thing out of the kit, uh, uh, yeah, the last two things out of the kit that I really like, I like this little lamp. And uh, uh, using the batteries that came in the box, uh, they lasted about eight hours total. Uh, and I used them straight through just to see what this little thing would do last night. Because it was the uh, first night I was running without a generator this week. Uh, and, or the, yeah, it wasn't last night, because I used a generator last night, the night before, uh, New Year's Eve, and this thing ran for eight hours that night, 
and batteries started dying off and the light started getting low to where you couldn't see much with it even though it was still lit you know given a little light it wasn't one that was seen very well so i i don't know what it's going to do with the ever -Readies, but it's still pretty bright little light and like i said for a couple days it'll or a couple hours a day it'll work for a night because that's about two or three hours all i use a night light at night anyway so and that'll save uh charging time on the battery bank but the thing i really like about that whole kit and the whole kit was all these flashlights were just 10 bucks for the whole flashlight kit and 17 batteries was this little thing it's a nice little headlamp and you got bright dim and then strobe so you know, you can use it as a defense weapon if you need to, or look in your hood, whatever, look outside, and you got your hands free. So, as an emergency, you know, I think those are, those are coming, coming handy, you know. Yeah, they're, they're waterproof, you know, they got, they're all sealed, they got O-rings into them, and the battery paint, the battery containing sealed, the lens concealed, the, and the reason I know that, I dropped one in a bucket of water, and it didn't shut off. So, I don't know about these. I, I guess I could test one of these and see if these are sealed enough to where they won't leak either, you know. Uh, but, I don't expect them to last too long. They seem to be made with less quality material, lighter material, but less quality material than uh, what my mag light is. And that other flashlight but that's the way it is with titanium and stuff that they're going to lighter metals and stuff you know that's interesting but i hope you all are happy i hope you're all doing well i'm doing well you guys keep up the good work and uh, we'll see you soon this is jack brown here at poor boy ranch saying see you later